Well, additional police will be patrolling Chicago streets after a night of looting and vandalism. The targets were hundreds of businesses in the city's downtown area. And although it started after a police shooting, the mayor says these were pure criminal acts. Sarah Blomquist is here now with us with more on what's being said and quite frankly, the mess left behind. Sarah. Yeah, it is a mess in Chicago today. Really a sad situation. Hundreds of looters and vandals descended on downtown Chicago early this morning following a shooting on the city's south side. They smashed the windows of dozens of businesses and made off with merchandise, cash machines and anything else they could carry. Hours earlier, police shot a man after he opened fire on the officers. A social media post then urged looters to converge on businesses, including Chicago's famed Magnificent Mile and its luxury stores. Hundreds of additional officers were dispatched. Over several hours, police made more than 100 arrests. 13 officers were injured. The mayor and police superintendent dismissed any suggestion that this chaos was an organized protest, calling it pure criminality. I don't care. I do not care. Whatever justification was given for this, there is no justification for criminal behavior ever. This is a beautiful city, and Chicago police officers will not allow this selfish criminal act to destroy what generations of hard work have built. A heavy police presence will continue in downtown Chicago for the foreseeable future. Officers will be working 12 hour shifts with no days off until further notice. The looting only brightened the national spotlight that's been on Chicago for weeks after a surge in gun violence that resulted in more homicides in July than any month in decades.